All right, everyone, how do we convert between atmospheres and millimeters of mercury? So pressure has many different units, and one of the units of pressure is called atmospheres, which we abbreviate as ATM, and another unit of pressure is called millimeters of mercury, which is abbreviated MMHG. So how do we convert between those two units? Well, we're gonna do a simple unit conversion here where we're gonna multiply what the problem gives us by a conversion factor. So for instance, in this example right here where we're gonna convert 1.1 atmospheres to millimeters of mercury, we're gonna start with 1.1 atmospheres and we're gonna multiply by a conversion factor which is a fraction, so I'll put a fraction bar in parentheses there and that will get us to what we're looking for which is millimeters of mercury now to solve this we need to have our units cancel out in the appropriate way so because we're starting with atmospheres that is going to need to go on the bottom of our conversion factor so that they cancel out because what's on top and on bottom cancels out. And since we're wanting millimeters of mercury, that's gonna need to go on top, okay? Now, the last thing we need is a relationship between atmospheres and millimeters of mercury. So, one relationship is right here, that one atmosphere equals 760 millimeters of mercury. So we can use that relationship to solve this conversion. So we're gonna have one atmosphere on the bottom, because again, we need atmospheres on the bottom, and we're gonna have 760 millimeters of mercury on top. Okay, so we're all set up. Looking at our units, atmospheres are going to cancel because atmospheres is on top here and on bottom of our conversion factor. So it will go away and we will be left with millimeters of mercury, which is the unit that we are converting to. That's the one we want. So we're all good with our units. Now we can do the math. So if we get our calculator, we are going to start with 1.1. And since we are multiplying by a conversion factor, which is a fraction, we're going to multiply by the top and divide by the bottom but the bottom is just one, so we can skip that because that won't change anything. So we're just gonna basically multiply by 760, hit enter, and our calculator says 836. So our final answer will be 836. Okay, so what if we wanna go the other way? So question here, what is 646 millimeters of mercury in atmospheres? So we're gonna convert from millimeters of mercury to atmospheres. So let's start with our 646 millimeters of mercury. And we're gonna multiply by a conversion factor. But since we're going in the other direction, we're starting with millimeters of mercury, this time that will be on the bottom of our conversion factor and atmospheres will be on top, okay? And using this, we should get atmospheres. Now again, we need that relationship between these two units. Well, 760 millimeters of mercury is one atmosphere. So if you notice, our conversion factor is the same as above except flipped. Okay, and why it's flipped is because since we're starting with millimeters of mercury, we need that to cancel out, so it must be on the bottom of our conversion factor, and atmospheres must be on top because that is the unit we want. So now we can do the math here. We're gonna start with 646. We're gonna multiply by the top of our conversion factor and divide by the bottom. The top is one, so we can skip that part. So we're basically just gonna divide by 760. Hit equals, and our calculator says 0.85. So our final answer here will be 0.85 atmospheres. 
Okay, there you have it, how to convert between atmospheres and millimeters of mercury. All right, if you want to see another example, click in the top right. Please like this video if it helped you in any way. Feel free to look in the doobly-doo below for additional help and resources. Please subscribe and ring the bell to get notified for new videos. And thank you, thank you so much for watching.